Hello, everyone. Continue to pray for my health, our finances, um, my depression and anxiety, worldwide salvation, worldwide poverty, um, Deem, always whining and stuff. Um, trying to think. My friend Bobby's health. A friends of mine that had their water turned off, it might be back on, but pray for them if it's not. Um, I think that's it. If you have prayer, just let me know. And 52 devotions for cat ladies. I'm going to have to order a new book soon. So it's in before this one's done. The Angel Cat. He will command his angels concerning you to guard you in all your ways. Psalm 91, 11. Chuck sat alone on the front porch feeling lost. Just a week ago, he and his wife had spent hours here talking and enjoying a spring afternoon. Now she was gone and Chuck didn't have anyone to talk to. As lonely thoughts ran through his head, Chuck felt something brush up against his leg. He looked down to see a cat with black and white fur. She circled his legs and began to explore the rest of the porch. Once the cat decided this was a good place to rest, she curled up on a pillow Chuck had laid beside his chair. She appeared relaxed and happy to have found a spot to rest. So you were lonely too, Chuck said. What's your name? I'm going to call you Ghost. You knew I could use a friend today. The cat's eyes watched Chuck as he spoke. Then they closed. Sleep well, Chuck said, smiling. I'm going to give it a shot myself. Chuck, or ghost helped Chuck through his loneliest days after his wife's death. They sat on the porch together every day. After several months, Ghost disappeared, and Chuck never saw her again. From that point on, he called Ghost the angel cat. Angels appear during times of need, helping us through the valleys of life. If we could view this spiritual realm, we would see the many times God has sent an angel to help us. Have you ever seen an angel? Maybe it was in the form of a friend. For Chuck, it was in the form of a cat named Ghost. Father, you are always with me and your angels are around me. Thank you for the times I've known that they were there, as well as the times I didn't realize they were working hard on my behalf. Maybe you can use me as a human angel. I am willing and I want to work for your kingdom in any way I can. What a privilege to be used that way. It is a comfort to know that I can count on your protection. Your angels are constantly at work. Pause to think. Can you remember time when you were aware of God's angel in your life? Did you know cats mark you as their territory when they rub against you? They have scent glands in their faces and bodies. Okay, I'm going to have to order another book. And that is it. I hope you guys have a blessed rest of your Tuesday. And pray for me that I can try to get some cleaning and stuff done. And later.